I'm Scott with Hammer in Hand uh, with a couple of quick updates on the Karuna project. A couple of things we're pretty excited about. Uh, on our last video, we uh, did a demonstration on our window install. Since then, we're building our, dra our uh, insulation and our drainage plane. A uh, couple of neat items. We're using a combination of the foil face on our polyiso as a drainage plane and then wrapping into the openings with uh, this vapor shield product, which is vapor permeable, and then detailing our sills with a wet flash. Kind of a hybrid of a bunch of different things. Uh, this product is easy to put on and it's quick, so it's perfect for vertical applications. It's also breathable. We can run that right into the window and then we caulk that joint right there with our, uh, with our uh, fast flash product. And then we run it down and then on a horizontal surface we're using uh, fast flash, Prosco. Uh, the beauty of this is it's uh, self-healing. So when we put our window pan in, we can run nails into this pro nails into this surface. It all self heals. It's also beveled. So if we have any window mal malfunction or failure, everything drains out onto this face, which is our drainage plane. This whole thing is on a rain screen. So uh, we have the beginnings of the rain screen here with our siding struts. We'll have some horizontal members that come across and then we have cedar siding that runs vertically. So there's about an inch and a half of air space. You get a bunch of air washing. Any, any water gets in here, it's all gonna just dry out. Uh, we're gonna go over and we're gonna take a look at what the window looks like when it's trimmed out. We have a mock-up already made. Here's our uh, window surround detail. Um, this is all 24 gauge uh, steel. It's uh, pre-primed, ready for paint. And you can see this track in here. This is going to be, this is going to accept a, uh, this has exterior uh, shades. Um, this is where the motor is housed. There's a track that fits right into this slot and drops down. So if the house gets too hot, hot day, they can drop the shades down and set them at any angle uh, they need. Um, down below here, we've got our sill pan. This vertical leg ties right into our OptiWin windows. I think it's cocked and, and driven right up into a, a little uh, slot that's provided in the window itself. You can see we've got kind of back dams here and then dams here, and then our siding comes out to this face right, right, on, right out here. So again, we have that inch and a half of airspace on our uh, rain screen. If there is any failure of any of these units here, the steel or the window, uh, it goes into our drainage plane uh, below our sill pan, which has our uh, our uh, uh, wet flash system on it and then out onto uh, our drainage plane. That's the window detailing. You can kind of see over here, we haven't flashed these yet. These are our wood members that go, these, these tie in to the framing of the house. You can see that a little down the way. It's, it's basically like a Z drag. And then we take this vapor shield product and we tape these seams. So these, these seams get taped vertically the whole way down. It's one continuous piece the whole way down that covers up our screws that are holding the polyiso on and it, and it protects the, these wood members. Um, this product is also uh, vapor permeable, so if any w water was to get in here, it can breathe out. So that's what we've been up to at Karuna the last couple of weeks. Our next installment will be on um, right before we go to cover on the inside and right before we go to the cover on the outside. We're gonna go into sheetrock and siding about at the same time and we're gonna do an overview of all the systems before we go to cover.